Hello, we've been um, blessed with a very good sunny day for September today and I've been able to work, carry on working on this painting which was of a branch up here, a twisted branch. Now if you look at my painting and you look at the um, branch up there you'll see that I, obviously I've not involved everything in my painting and the reason being as I was trying to create it's like a twist in my branch, in my, in my picture, like a twist and then it going off to the angle, going off to the varying directions of the canvas. And um, I've got to, I haven't actually properly painted, finally painted in the, the, the colour in the background to unite the, color, the same blue throughout. But um, and it is a matter of really pulling it to um, a satisfactory conclusion, um, which I'm hoping to be able to do tomorrow or the next day to finally finish it. Um, but it's been a, it's, it's an exciting subject matter, which, um, for me anyhow, and trying to, and trying to, to get a sense of simplicity, as I felt was very important. It's obviously, I'm working with oil paint, and because I reacted very badly to the, um, to using white spirit, I've in fact been using, um, a, a very good um, replacement terp, uh, replacement for terps and I was quite asthmatic uh, at the end of yesterday but today I'm um, I'm breathing much more easily having used this replacement substitute um, which I know that quite a lot of people have the problem with I've got uh, the light, of course, now has changed by the end of the day. But um, what I try to do so that I can work on a picture through the day, I try to get an. Um, I, I try to use the light and remember it um, during the day. What are the best bits of light that I'm wanting to use to create um, a three dimensional painting? mixing up the colours to my rather dirty plate. So, um, and the blacks, well, almost blacks that I've got here will look appear black and contrast to the blue. They're like a very dark brown I've made with green and cadmium orange. Um, 